Hello everybody, I'm Martin Gonzalez. I live here in Paris, California. And we're at the Farmer's Fair here in the Paris grounds. Um, look at my stuff. Come by, have fun. There's a lot of stuff going out here. So what is your stuff? My stuff is all the junk items that I make into different uh, sculptures. And uh, I'm with uh, the Metal Corral. Uh, um, I work with him. His name is Arturo Castellanos, out of Rosarito. And that's some of the sheet metal that you see here. Here's some more items right here. This is made out of none but junk. It's what it is, like a rooster. And here's another one, the peacock. I made this one a few months ago. I made this one a couple of months ago. I finished this one off today. What is that? It's just like a bird. I threw it over the fence and it's cast iron, so it broke. So I mended it all together and I thought about it and I said, well, you know, one creation making another kind of sort of. Yeah. You know. So you don't bend any pieces. All you do is you take existing pieces and just weld them together and create, yeah. A, yeah, create an you, art project. Right. As you can see, this is like a piece of hammer, a wrench, an old jack, you know, uh, parts to, to cars, odds and ends broken things and collection of different little items so you've got a pretty good imagination right just try to make something out of it my grandson helps me yeah and what this is what we do all day uh that's my uh, friends out of uh the metal corral in rosarito like i said arturo castellanos and his two sons uh dante and jonathan they help me a lot with this uh with the sculptures it's uh a frame basically starts like this there it is this is a rabbit and then yeah. you'll be adding on pieces to that? Exactly, you fill it in. You could make uh, some of it, or you can uh, do like what I call a, uh, like a full metal jacket. So that's what the horse is, a full metal jacket? Yes, it's completely covered. Only the mouth is open and the bottom of the hoof, so you can install it in your property. Okay. What do you think of these sculptures? I, I think they're beautiful. Really, they're cool. So open, crack open that wall and let's get some. <laughs> Put it right in my front lawn, right? Exactly, so here's the... Do you want to meet the artist? You want to meet the artist? Well, sure. Didn't you? you I was just see. Oh, hi. How you I'm, doing? My name is Judy. I uh, Judy? I heard you were moving. No, that's somebody else. Oh, somebody <laughs> oh okay. I didn't know no, there were two yeah. people that did this work. Yeah, I'm getting confused a lot with the, the, the other guy. Yeah. Computer, yeah. yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah, my stuff is uh, his stuff is nothing but sheet metal, and I use more like the junk pieces, you know, leftover yeah, broken no, shovels and stuff that I use at work. Well, I've done, you know, work in the past. What Chains, little pieces. Like These are out of Rosarito, the metal corral. And uh, there's different prices. The small ones are 30, the big ones are 50. Uh, yeah. miles away from here. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I like the I like the grass. It's a little warm, are you sure you want me to wrap it up for you? No, I think we're gonna This is one of my horses yeah. right here. So it's what pieces do you use? A little bit of everything as you can see. Just to try to give it a little bit of what it should look like. So it's not a full covered Full metal no, jacket. No, you could always add more to them. As I find pieces, I add more to it. So it's just more work and a uh, little bit more detail. So of course the price got to go up a little bit. Depends how it comes out, you know. So if I pick this horse up today and I want more pieces on it, you could come out and add pieces to it? You yourself? Yeah, even if you have a special piece from, you know, maybe your grandparents or your mom and dad or something, you know, of course we can you know, incorporate it somehow in there. Okay. Yeah. All right, so what do you got behind the horse? Uh, a lot of animals, different things. So what's that dinosaur on the wall? Yeah, it's uh, so you can put it on your wall. Some people just want to 
they don't have enough space for something like this bigger item over here. So they'll take a partial. Right. They think it's funny, you know, or you can paint and look like like it went through the wall or something oh, like so that. Oh, so they're paintable. You can uh, paint. No, I'm saying the wall. Oh, got you can it, paint got the it. wall, you know, or... Oh, yeah, they're paintable, as you can see, but it just depends how much you take care of the paint. Of course, the weather, you know, is going to do what it's going to do to it. Yeah, but that's... It's one of my big pieces. It's, uh, it's uh, like a country swing. Oh, okay. And... Right below the shark. Yes. Sit down, relax, you know, after... Oh, that is nice. Afternoon, and... There's another one of my pieces is just... This you could just buy in any store, but these are like leftovers from construction sites and stuff that they junk. And I go junking and get it from the scrapyard or the scrap guys. And it's an old bed post that I bought somewhere. Try to make it into something, you know? Oh, I didn't realize this is uh, actually right in front of the camera. You've got a flapping bird, right? Yeah, it's balanced. Here's cool. another one. Like, like an owl. Okay. So, if I want to contact you, how do I do that? Um, you call me on my cell phone. <laughs> it's and the best thing. It's, uh, sometimes I shut it off because I'm working, I'm grinding. So, what's uh, the number? Uh, area code 951-322-9915. And ask for? Martin Gonzalez. Do you have any Just Facebook? Martin. Just Martin. Any Facebook? Any websites? No, nothing like that. Here's customer now. <laughs>